and we're back uh, after dinner. Randall is the only guy who hasn't moved yet. Yes! Yes, exactly! Randall, I already love you. I kind of feel like I could be down here being a pain in their backside, right? How have they not done these jobs yet? I still can't believe that. Get down here, come in. No, I can't get that. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I wasn't serious. Um, kind of feel like actually could Stig do that? Hang on, that's not uh, that's her there. So that's an army that I really could have used to do that sneaky underground set of jobs. Uh, it's still a thing. I don't know. Oh, like I'll do this. Something to do. <clears throat> Nothing back home to build. Just Dragon Vault and or Tomb of Souls. Tomb of Souls. Let's finally build it. Start saving them. There's probably at least 20 we're missing. We should have, have saved up by now. <clears throat> it just goes to show... That's how far down I think about them. And plus, on top of that, I'm nearly sure in the vanilla game, you can't get to your Black Knights. I'm pretty sure... You can't have those cool units until you've done Tomb of Souls, so they're just acu ac accumulating naturally in the background. So I was surprised to see you can get all the way to dragons without ever bothering with the Tomb of Souls. Um, so, where's the action? What are we interested to see? Oh, okay, yeah, we're, we're looking down here. Aiden, our new guy. Can't believe we picked that up, that crystal. That's just amazing. Tan, what are you going to do? You're not going to do anything. You're, uh, you're useless. No, it's just woeful. Terrible. Orange. We're probably going to have to accept that Orange does that. That's fine. Orange gallops through there. Blue and pink and pink are sort of dancing around one another. Could eventually be a pain in hell. So Marist ran off that way. I think I do want to... That's actually not useless, that wood. Get into trouble, I could maybe try to summon boat here. Oh, the movement points are so bad. Okay, that's right. Stiggy. So, that's an alternative use of Stig, but it's a long way back. She's got to sail all the way back down here. And in that time, I could just give Ranlu some troops. Okay, this is their home base. Pink. Pink is a tower hero, right? Fafner. Yep. The cat's away! Oh well. He'll surely do something about that before. <laughs> I could just stand on the road here and see what happens. How far away is the cat? Let's have a quick look at the map. Helps a little bit. Although we've got a pretty good idea of what's going on anyway. I'm just going to stand here like a jerk. What are you going to do about it? Who do you have? I guess as long as there's at least... Yeah, if the troops are still here waiting to be purchased. But it's day six, so I'm guessing they're off doing something. Either Stig's getting absolutely annihilated tomorrow, or I might be getting a town cheap. That would be very annoying if I was them. Right, these heroes need to remind me. Aiden, I need intel. Get back there. Do it. Who's here? No one. Great. Great. Good, 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 good. Excellent. Okay, no more cover of darkness. Man, that hurt. Having cover of of darkness on us. Okay, so we're still very close to Fafna. He could ride up to here anytime he wants. Uh, if he was to do that, we would die. Sepchani, you could have got there by riding through here, could you? Mm. Okay, that's still the fastest route for her to do that. She comes back to here. Is that a fight she wants to do? Yes, we will win that fight. In my opinion, 
Is there anything better she could be doing instead, like riding further out this way, getting this campfire? Going upstairs? There's a subterranean gate I could come up here? Nagash, why don't you answer some questions for me? Find out what that does. What do I want to trade? So I get great rates here, right? Can sell some excess resources. We don't want to go overboard here. But this is just a really good opportunity, I think, to make some money. Um, don't want to go bananas. Just like to keep a nice sort of baseline, but that's pretty good. We're up to 30k. And now, mate, while you're here, can you tell me what a mineral spring does? Did you go here? So, horses look less than thrilled to drink the salty water, but soon you notice them prancing around with new vigour. Rainbow forms in the droplets above the sparkling spring, and the sight brings everyone to a happy mood. And it even looks like, if you look closely, it even looks like he's grinning, doesn't it? Can I get a better picture of him? That's the biggest picture I can show you, unless I figure out a way to zoom. It does look like he's smiling, don't you think? Nagash, he's actually enjoying himself. He's like, you know what, finally a campaign where I don't have to run around and do everything. You know, so refreshing. I don't need to be in charge. Take defense, there's a portal here. Happy for him to get interrupted and we'll just bank the scouting. Nimbus, meanwhile, uh, do I really want to sail into the corner and back? I think I do. So much wood you can get. Okay. Uh, Ranlu, and then this fellow. Yeah, so I don't think I could, I get to go up here because of the, um, the risk of Fafner. Now, having said that, if Fafner comes through and kills Aiden, he's a sitting duck. He's a dead man. Right? What I really want to do is start linking up my logistics, right? So I want Aiden and... Um, Ranlu ready to connect the towns together. We want to bring everything from Cold Soul over to Dark Eternal for upgrading. Okay. And we're going to want the. Surely we're going to want to start Bone Dragons now as well. Surely. We can pile into Bone Dragons and both go to Ghost Dragons in our home base, really get that production line going, maybe build up two armies. Um, can reconquer the stronghold would be another option. Probably going to be a balance of all of all of that, right? You're good. You're good. Get back here. Right, hold tight for now. The dragon vault. I'm. I'm just going to build it, guys. It's probably about a week late, probably two weeks late, maybe. But it's just the right answer. Now, how much does it cost me to get the next thing? 15 and 20 mercury. I'd actually forgotten that it was 20 mercury. I probably would have been a li little less gung-ho with trading away all my mercury, but the gold really helps, you know? It gives you a cushion you can invest. <clears throat> I'm taking financial advice from a vampire, but... When you're right, you're right. I don't think uh, Fafna can afford to come and challenge me. I think he's in a pickle. He's in a pickle and he knows that he can't use any of the stronghold troops that are there. Besides, I bought them all, so there aren't any. So even next week, though, all he can do is hire a second hero to run around with one week's worth of troops while hoping to not die to Teal. But I think Teal is in really big trouble from judging from the... Thieves, uh, Thieves Guild. Let's do what we want to do. Okay. Sorry. I 
took way too long for me to decide. If he comes and kills Aiden, that's great. That just saved me movement points. Right. What else do I want to invest in here then? Is it time to do a Dragon Vault here too? And then we'll just take our time next week buying all the creatures? Yeah, yeah, that could be right. Just take our sweet, sweet time getting the production line set up. I could also go Transformer into Unearthed Graves. Let's do it. Okay. Bone Dragon Online. Right, Faf, what are you doing? You're gonna faff around, are you? What? Brief respite we had from green is no more. Pink's defending itself. Okay. I I, I see that. And I see I see the, where I went wrong. Uh, I want to say I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Um, I didn't mean it. And I'll just be. Uh, I'll just be getting. But now I know where you live. And I can have a look in at you anytime I want. But you cannot say the same thing about me. Stiggy. How good is Stig, man? She's just like... Look at her. It looks like she's actually going to join back up with the others now. Nag. Okay, Nimbus. I'll give you one more day, man. Yeah, I'll, I'll do one more map reveal with him before I decide what to do. Now, Septiana can probably do this today. She could grab a behemoth first. Aiden, I'm just going to go do all these things. Yeah, it's good. Ah, uh, okay. Did she just go for it? I don't have time to mess around, do I? I'd like to mess around, go here first. Stay seven, so don't, don't. She does have time. She has time. Take the power this time. She has time, right? Oof. Maybe not. <laughs> well, but then again, let's say he buys all of the creatures. Like, then what? Then he's just doing what I did to him last time. He's just spending ten grand or five grand to um, give me a bloody nose. Like, it's not going to be a very good investment. I don't get to use the troops, but, you know. Okay, so Marist, we didn't see Marist come back. So I kind of want to be cheeky. Get to the road. Oh man, <laughs> I'm walking right up to the... <laughs> okay. Well, again, it reveals certain truths. It, re it reveals the, the town, even if it's cost us the hero. I don't know that she'll be available like when we come back tomorrow, right? Because she's because it's the end of the week, so I don't know how, that, how that's going to work. Um, right, let's get... So he's ready to rock, but he doesn't need to be there. Well, he does if he wants the Vampire Lords, so that's fine. He sits there, does the Vampire Lords. Um, Nagash is a long way out of the loop, but ideally he would be usable. So it's that one there. Yeah, it's that there, so he comes out down here. He would be usable as the go-between hero. Um, we don't want her. I don't think we want him, no. Um, so I can either do that, but I think I just want to do this first, just to see where that is. Ah, that's how Tan took the necropolis. Hmm. Very interesting. 
because it means that it means that it's not very far from our home, right? That's about a day and a half, a day and a third. And then you've got to go to there. So call it two and a half days. And then on the other side, you've got another day, a three day journey. It's a three day journey from the Necro to the fortress. That is always go through portals if you can. You know, because you can always push the space bar. It gives you this nice blob of scouting. You get this huge reveal, all for the cost of whatever moves it took you to step onto it. Never just leave them unlooked at, you know. Let's actually just reveal some of this because it can't be unrevealed. And they can't kill us both. <laughs> they can't kill both me and G. I'm happy with that, that's fine. Trading post there's really nice as well, it's really handy. Just come back, man, just come back. So we've got plenty of notice if Tan wants to engage us again. Okay, feeling good, feeling all right. No more investments are needed in either location, don't think. Let's check Cold Soul isn't in need of anything specific that we can't do that in time, we don't have enough time. We don't, but I bet you I forget next week to build it on day six and seven, or whatever. Uh, I should have flagged that, it would have given us plus one zombie growth, um, but yeah, she was in a hurry. Okay, Fafna, I hope I can get to you, jeez, I hope I haven't messed that up by going there. You don't know what you're about. You don't know what you're doing. Terrible. Just terrible. You don't know what you're doing with your life. Oh, okay. Ooh, sprite population doubles. Okay, so pink has designs on this area, which I'm totally fine with. I've got no judgment. So Sepchena may need to... Okay, here's a question. Could one of these heroes beat Melodia if I gave them the army? Um, let's have a look by doing it this way. Here's the army. And here's Melodia. Nine Titans. No, that's that's too hard. Let's say she's a B hero and Fafner's their main hero. I don't like it, right? I really don't like it. So, hmm. Anyway, tell me where you are and whether you can get to the stronghold. I don't think she can. I think I've messed up. Now there's sprites everywhere in my way. Can't get through there? Oh, oh that could be a problem. They're everywhere. Oh. That's a nuisance. What about up here? No, okay. Should I do that first? I don't think I can get there. Oh, I can. What's my moves remaining? 448, I've got tons of moves. Tons? <laughs> what are you worried about? <laughs> Am I serious about doing this fight? Yes, Fafner's dead. He dies in this fight. Unless he's built an escape tunnel. This is too good. And um, it's day one, so I buy all the stronghold stuff that's here and gallop back up and deal with my other problems. Green is still threatening to try to break out, but their army is good. <sighs> it's going to be a fun old time. We're just doing this fight, we are. We're just doing it. Oh, 
god. Yeah. A hundred spell points. He's a decent hero. Okay. So he has expert haste. We've seen that before. Let's see what he has to offer. Okay. Say that I think I'm going to clone something now. The only problem is it's very expensive. 20. Temporary duplicate stack. The image is dispelled if it's damaged or if the prototype dies. Each unit may have only one clone, does not affect war machines. The clone is alive for the number of rounds equal to the spell power, so it'll be alive for ages. Although he has some dampening thing going on, I only have power 7. I've just noticed the little bracket there, he's got this interference skill, which is... Yeah, that's why that's only 225. Okay, 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 I'm starting to get the picture here. So that means Animate Dead only restores 410. Wow. And this fight's really hard. Yeah, I think I want to try cloning um, the Skellies. Or Zombies, just to, just to see an experiment with that. Um, I think I'm going to try and pile into the Naga Queens and work on them. And that'll be my plan. Do our ground attack here. Which is just a lish. Do I prefer that to the genie, to this or that? Yeah, let's try to do, let's do this. So that hurt like hell. Excellent. Okay, so take the retaliation for me. That's a good lad. Alright, let's, let's give this a try. You killed two? So I've got vamps, black knights, these and these still to go. So you walk to here. They've got five left. So I could take the, hmm. yeah, 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 yeah. I don't actually need to use the Black Knights on the Nagas now. But I also don't need to waste my retaliation, guys. So I think you're not acting. You're going to do this. So it's basically a damage spell, right? So how much damage did the clone do? 241 damage for 20 spell points is just not a very good deal. So I think you need a bigger stack. 61 left. Try to kill that. Feed off him anyway, regardless. Four rows from the dead. Okay, that's not bad. We kill five to nine. I can do... A, yeah, so the average is about 300 dam. Which is just about bang on. Yeah, that's a pretty good stack for him to target, I think. I guess just come here then. That's nice. That's nice. That's nice. Shame there's still one there, but that's okay. Now we have to accept all of the slings and arrows. Clone is dead. That's gonna hurt. Ten die. Three come back. Well, that seems like a waste. So he's down to 26 dudes. And another 5, that's handy.
how good is this? Um, I could pick you. Is that better? Oh, look at that! Yeah, I forgot. The little blue outline is telling you who's vulnerable. Iron golems aren't alive, so they don't suffer from the periphery. But they will suffer if you go for them directly. Uh, and as you can see, my vampire lords won't. So if I want to hit them both, I need to do this or that. Sorry, this. Or I could try to just finish off that last Naga. She only has 46 HP left. Let me try attacking the golems without pushing G first. That should hit both. It does. Well, that's a terrible move by the Nagas. I actually can't get to them. Like, I'm worried there's a bit of a Pyrrhic victory here. I might need to teleport him in as well to finish the job. That's not going to be very good. Boom. the Naga gets to do money. Ah, Now all the ballers to kill her. Alright, my skelly's dead. Remember the big pile was there. Yuck. Haste is worn off? No, surely not. Okay, so he's, his dudes who do go first next round. I'm really in strife here though. Um, so they've already fought. Okay, they've done their thing. So I'm actually going to do this first and then animate after? Is that stupid? It's probably stupid. It's safe, right? It's safe. They're not going to die. The thing is, with the, t the arrow tower and lightning bolt, it's going to just really hurt me anyway. See? Oh, that's good, actually. That's ideal. Because I can... Okay, I guess I'll go for uh, the skellies. What have I got left now? I can do one more after this. Kills 8 to 12. But if I do that, he will retaliate. Are we happy to just call it here? I'm not going to overthink it, right? He's got arrow towers, he's got lightning bolts. I'm just going to end the game. I think I had 41. Oh, well, let's find out. Costly fight. Well, ugh, 241 I had. Good God. Oh, no, hang on. It doesn't count the ones that came back. I think that's the total that... Do no, no, no. That is, that's the net loss. 241 skellies. But we killed Fafner, and hopefully 13 attack on a wizard hopefully is a very nice artifact for us. We've got 5,000 experience. That's a huge win, Septiana. Oh, look at all the stuff. You've trapped him in base. Let's have a look at what we've got. Oh, my God. Worn on the head. Knowledge plus two. 
dragon wing on the shoulders gives you power plus two. Pendant of negativity means you can't hit me with lightning bolt. Trident of dominion is new to me? <laughs> Yowza, is that a combination artifact? Whoa, plus seven. Brilliant. Duration doesn't help me much. <clears throat> yeah, this is okay. We know about this. Any more? <laughs> what is up? Go for it. Third level units. There's a morale banger for you. Although I've got the spirit of oppression. Archery, great. Pendant of death. You can't use destroy undead on me. That's pretty good. Attack plus four, so we've got tons of artifacts. And this is the thing I was getting into before, talking about you with luck. You can actually have negative luck caused by enemy artifacts. What a cool little artifact. If I click this tick, what happens? Okay, that's it. She finally figures out how to be a better scholar. I'll take that. Ooh, I'll take that. Expert earth magic, give it to me. Okay, that was a good trade. I'm so I have to say, trapping a premier hero in a town, stealing all of his stuff. Look at her stats now, 14, 7, 14, 16. She doesn't even have enough room on her body for all of this stuff. Look at all this stuff I've got. What a ninja. Oh man, how good is this? So this is not a combo artifact because it would be blanking out of the sectors of my outfit so just a big fat plus seven to attack that's huge imagine that on the vampires it's gonna be epic 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 what a fight what a hold what an effort she's nearly out of moves how about we spend the night get our spell points back that's incredible now we have to go into planning how do I disseminate these artifacts how do I build a second superhero? Who is my second hero? How do I make them a superhero? Like, I'm going through the roster. I'm looking to promote someone here. Right? We've got Septiana at level 14. Everyone else is a total noob. And we need to pick somebody to get behind. And uh, to, to promote into something special. Okay, level 1, level 1, level 1. 2 level 3, 1 level 3 and 2 level 4s. Wow, what a fight. So nice. I was actually quite worried for a second when I saw the 100 spell points in the expert haste. I was like, oh, jeez. Plus the auto combat that said I was dead meat. This looks like a hard decision, so I'll come back to it. Um, Mr. Nimbus. Oh, Nimbus. I take it all back. What's this my mermaids? <sighs> I'm actually tired. I'm exhausted from that. So she never got her comeuppance. What's that about? So I can just run through this way? You let me? If I can get past a horde of sprites, which I don't think I can. A horde of sprites. Very risky. But she might die anyway if I don't. Could go here. I might just do this with G. Sorcery. Um, okay, I'll take it. Can I have these lizard men? Are you gonna let me have them? I'm just gonna go for a wander through your territory. Try to make it down to there. If she gets tagged, she gets tagged. That's okay. Um, nothing I can do about that, really. Uh, do this. <clears throat> Aiden goes and finds some mercenaries hidden in the middle of nowhere. So that's fine. He's coming back more or less this way. Ranlu, it's day one. You did your job of... Right. So... We also have all of these creatures. Oh, man. 
when a plan comes together. You know what I'm going to do, people? I'm going to have myself a Milky Way. Just so good. <clears throat> so good. Septiana, you are a absolute legend. Look at me. How much stronger could she be if I put on some of the things? Rough terrain without penalty, or I could have a bit more knowledge and power. Extra spell point per day. Oh man, yeah. Sorry, I didn't realise that was... Uh, one of them. Got the loins. Your morale doesn't matter, so... No, wait. Negates positive morale? So it does actually count. Okay. Um, inexhaustible or... There's no luck? Okay. Didn't I get this stuffy doll thing? What is it? Shaman's puppet? Decreases your luck by two. Seems better than neutralising all luck. What does that do? Duration plus one doesn't matter. Duration is totally fine now, so we'll wear, the, we'll wear that. Attack and defence plus one. All my guys are a bit more healthy. Duration plus two. Okay, let's swap that out. Uh, I want to get the ore. Yeah, okay, well let's do that. Actually, maybe it's the orb. I, I'm not, I, don't, I don't know ice, I still don't know ice bulb. So, it's just not doing enough, I think this does a bit more. Uh, I can always swap the uh, card of ore out and give that to a bee hero as soon as I meet one. Now I've got a second copy of the chest, so that needs to find its way to a hero that's waiting. Ah, oh, this is excellent. So good. I'm just trying to think strategically though, how do I deal with green? And that means the army should be central. I feel like the army should be generally central. She's staying the night. Okay, so don't make that mistake. But yeah, we want the army to be fairly central. And accessible. I'm gonna guess that there are sprites blocking that now, but I can probably kill them. Because I know stuff and I'm a powerful mage. Yeah, I know tons of stuff. I know Death Ripple. Can I do that? It's a useful thing I could actually do for the team. A horde? What does Death Ripple do for me? 45 points of dam. They have about 3 HP each. No, it's too hard, isn't it? Let me just walk around them. Looks like there's one here too. Which is not good. Quite annoying for her. Okay, I think that was worthwhile. It's a bit of a scam. Uh, I think I'll step off. I'll step off just in the spirit of good sportsmanship. If it comes down to kills, kills Stig, I mean, I lose this army, but then I respawn here and I can buy all these things. Which will all die and we'll lose the town, but. Again, bloody nose. Well, hopefully. See, she's very strong. Like, depends if she's not a good spellcaster, though. It might, it might be more of a pain in the backside than it looks for her. Um, I have to make a decision. Let's just see what she does. She might just gallop back up again. It's like, oh, good, I've chased away that interloper. Uh, mission accomplished kind of thing. Nag, come on down, man. Get into position here, we're going to need to start forming the supply chain. Ramlu, I'm actually thinking like that. 
for him. So maybe it's a bone dragon for now. Our first bone dragon. Uh, maybe a white too, actually. This seems really good, getting this online. Okay. Should we hire Sorsha now? Is there any reason to do so? Yeah. Save your money. Tan. Is that, uh, was that Tan Hero? Thingy? Ooh. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, no, we're in massive trouble now. We're gonna lose our hometown. Ranlu should be able to get back. Alright, it's really bad news. Um, I'm afraid the whole army <laughs> is upon us. Uh, so while the cat's been away, that, that, that's been happening. She's stuck with these, but they're the same speed as the zombies, so... How... How heavily should I jump into this, uh, uh, the stuff that's here? Hide back there with Ranlu. We can't link up, there's no hope. Yeah, and there's no hope of getting the army back. Septiana comes out through here. Nagash grabs the army, comes galloping down. Is there any hope? Let's see, how far can you go, love? No, you'll be exhausted. I still have a few moves left. Sure, you get to about here. And then if you stand here... And the next day he can get to about there. Now, nah, Randall, you're on your own, mate. <sighs> what if I hide another hero out of here, though? She came to here. It, this person galloped down to there. Came to there. Nagash could be about here with the army. Oh, but then I don't think Nagash can win. He can't win. <laughs> She's got like tons of phoenixes. Alright. Alright. Ranlu, you're gonna have to do a job for us, man. Oh boy. This is so sad. All these units are dead. Do this. really bad. Such a waste, man. Such a waste. A whole week's worth of dudes. I got no choice. I got to, yeah. He's caught me out. He's caught me off guard. I mean, it's all, he's always been a thorn in my side, that fella. He really has. Aiden, come do that. Oh no, Stig can do that. Yeah, all my heroes, they were all just a day away from recalibrating and getting together again. Ah, oh, look at that. Ugh, I just had... Mm. 
While he's up there, though, he's not going to find it easy. Right, let's say he takes the town, kills me. Then what does he do? He has to escape. He has to come build a boat and stuff, so I'll be right on his tail. I'd rather be on his tail with Stig than with this guy, but I don't, know, I just don't have a choice. Do I care about this graveyard? I don't think, like, Aiden could get that, right? I'd rather get Stig into the action. Come on. Come on, man. Wait, go here. Okay. Alright, where can Sepchi and I get to? He'll have to do this for me so I can see where she can get to. She can't check. I can't even check. Ugh. Oof. Oof. She can get to about there, I guess. Maybe a bit further if Stig helps. Try to be optimistic. Go here. Not good. I spent all the money. Unless I can find you some. Three of these bad boys available. That's awesome. You've never bought. You've never bought them. What? We've been here for two months and you haven't bought a single one. Well, I don't want to buy sixty-three. I don't think I want to buy any. I mean, I'll just leave you to it, right? Just come down here, get out of the swamp. Alright, this is terrible. This is really gonna hurt like hell, but it's the price we pay for smashing Fafner. Oh, come on, this feels gross. Ugh. No, <laughs> green. Green, please. You don't wanna do this. You don't wanna do this. Okay, okay, that's a day. Okay, let's see what's possible. Okay, I can get the army there, right? The problem is that that army doesn't join up. Okay, that's the army, but you got to picture it. Septiana can get him the artifacts, though. How good is this hero? Let's have another look. Who we're up against? 6, 10, 11, 10. Number of towns? Purple. Oh yeah. Um, don't mean we're winning as such. I'm still terrified of orange. Orange Israel looks amazing. But we're up there, we're competing, right? In terms of power level. That's Melodia! Right? So she's not good. Pretty good army, but she's not actually that good. And I feel like blue and red are just... Red's just in the background. Marist isn't getting any stronger. The only reason I care about green is because they're trying to kill me. So, crazy thought. What if I let Anarian take the town? Alright, let's just do this quickly. I'm going to say yes. Do I have to lose any troops here? Yeah, I'm just going to auto-accept this. Hope you guys are cool with that. Now, this girl here, Stig, could pop in here on her way down. Uh, and grab... Certainly the Bone Dragons. The Zombies. The Warriors. Let's 
Let's do that. Yeah, they're not cheap. Okay, great. I need to get this girl to the base. I just have to decide then what it looks like back home with Ran Lu, what strategy I'm going to use. So Sep Chen is going to start learning and teaching. Is there any chance you could learn blind? Oh no, she knows blind. Yeah, great. Stig's, I'm hoping Stig will be my secondary hero. Oh yes, and we can also give artifacts. Okay, this isn't how I'd plan to do this. I can be stuck with these because I'm going to insist on zombies. Somehow I lost my tent, so give me that one. Take these. Yeah, so Stig, I want to turn you into something that matters. You can buy a new first aid tent for yourself back at the base there, so... Take this, I don't want this. Take these pieces of junk, uh, scrolls that I can't get rid of. I don't know archery. Um, Alright, that's an easy one. Have that. Uh, yeah, duration matters more to you than it does to me. Sure. And actually, there's the combo artifact I had a couple of runs ago with Conjuring, if you get the cape of Conjuring. Now, luck and luck don't go together, so someone else needs to have that instead of me. I want to move without penalty. I do, but at the same time, well, it doesn't. I'm on 14. Take these. I think you'll benefit from it more than I will. I'll keep the orb. I might keep this. Do I want someone else to have these? Definitely, yes. Do I want the whites? Sepchena, she crashes through here. Same again, I say. Yep, it's fine. It's exactly as far as she can get. So Nagash can bring the army to about here. Ranlu does have the moves, I think, to go and get it. So how should we play this? I don't know. Like, it's so easy to mess up, right? I guess the first thing we have to ask, ask ourselves is, do we want either Ranlu or Nagash? Kind of doesn't matter who. Because, I mean, if I knew Dispel, it would be okay. I guess I do. I can Dispel till the cows come home. And that's nice. That That's nice to be able to do that. But let's say it's... Okay, so let's say it's Nagash. Do we want Nagash? And... Yeah, this army. you got to imagine this. these two armies glued together. Okay, there's 33 liches, there's 52 vampires, 14 dread knights, 6 bone dragons. I think this is the move. I think this is what we're supposed to do. Whereas this guy just gives you one round of arrow tower and happy, happy enough. Yeah, I like this idea. Run to the hinterland. And if he wants to follow me, that's okay. He'll be way out of position. If he gets me, if he catches me, I'll be sad. She might, now that I'm looking at it, but he, at least he'll be out of position, and 
it'll be a very less comfortable fight, but yeah. So we could actually get ready to deliver um, the secondary troops here, right? We could do this. Can you scout this for me, man? Can't get through there. Oh, maybe I could. A horde of sprites? What can I do? Can I kill them? <sighs> no. It's a very bad hero. Too hard? Just want to get that. What's up there? Town gate? Ooh. Very cheap, very, very, very poor man's town portal. Uh, yeah, just get some useful scouting done here. Pen the free will. Horde of pikemen, too hard. Okay, that's something useful he did. Nimbus, you do something for me, will you? Oh, I missed this. What is that? School of magic, plus one sparrow knowledge. No, 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 no. No, Nimbus. Nothing can be found this time. Flotsam that away. Get it. Yes, Nimbus. The value printer. The closer. Oh, bloody things. Oh, come on, she's Death Ripple Queen, isn't she? No, that's Septiana. These are all the spells I know. I never learned Death Ripple. Oh, I can't do that fight. That's so depressing. Does she know Summon Boat? She does. Try to get yourself your boat. Yay! Alright, get in. I'm um, just thinking we can get ready to configure our secondary hero. Uh, Alagard better stay out of my way, or he's gonna regret it. Well, actually, that's kind of annoying. I was gonna, I was wanting to put Stig here. Yeah, but then having said that, uh, I'm trying to work this out. Sorry, sorry, sorry. We know she's coming to there. So I could put Stig just behind her and be happy with that. because Alagar would be committing suicide by coming anywhere near me. And now I'm ready to buy stuff. Okay. If Alagar wants to gallop through here and kill Stig, that's absolutely just fire the music to my ears. She'll flee. Yeah, no, he's just not, that's just not going to happen. As soon as he sets eyes on her... He, he will be sprinting in this direction. Monstrous hero. But, she's some way away from rescuing the town. Okay, I don't know if this was a good play or not, running into the uh, off into the abyss. I don't know if Ranlu can maybe try to summon a boat. He's got one shot at glory, summoning a boat here, but even then he, get, he gets caught on the boat. Um, but I can bring the rest of these troops up in Cold Soul. Uh, yeah, I can bring them with me. I'll be a day behind with them. And if he's all the way up there, you know what she's doing? She's just going to gallop down here. That's what I'm going to do. That's what's going to happen to you. Come, come, in, come into my doorstep, do ya? Alright, do it. Oh. Um, yeah, but if I retreat, she just dies immediately? Like, that's not how this works, so I'm not gonna retreat. Okay, it's Merist getting vengeance. Oh. So her army used to be astonishingly good, and now I'm looking at it thinking 
It's not actually that good. She's a good spellcaster though, look at that. What's something mean I can do to you before I run away? 42 points of damn. What? It said 42 points of damn. Kill zero? Why is damage 10? Okay, there's obviously an artifact at play that's causing me to deal a quarter of the damage. Oh, she cast protection from air, did she? Protection from earth and magic arrows and earth spell? Okay. I can't think of anything else to do though. You don't have a stack that's going to take a single casualty, that's so depressing. Um, I surrender. No, that's okay, I'll just run. Yeah. Sweet vengeance, alright. Come on, Anarian, let's go. You... You coward! Oh, okay, orange is here. So, Sorsha? You know that thing I said I wanted you to do? Okay, let me just quickly check who these pink people are before I... Right, that's Melodia doing her thing out there in the world. That's Moandor? A weird-looking secondary hero with morale that must be in the absolute gutter. I can only imagine. How many troop types are there there? One, two, three, four, five troop types and undead. So, okay. Wow to that. Now, who's this? Chana? Okay. Do we, do we care if she's out there running around? Do I need to buy Sorsha? I don't know if I care about her. Having said that, I could hire Sorsha, go get the behemoth, but then she will need to stick around for now. Right, who do I get? Let me just check again. Tavern. Oh no, Sorsha's long gone. I could get G back here though. That could work. She's a decent hero. Better than Sandro, obviously. Yeah, okay. Uh, I think G has taken Sandra's place. Sorsha. Sorsha, I mean. Right, Chana's not, a, not our main focus. Our main focus is Anarian. Anarian the Coward. We all know what he's going to do. As soon as I get near him, he's going to go back down through there. He's going to pretend none of this ever happened. Okay, I sat and stared at it here. I think Septiana is going to be strong enough to beat an Aryan behind a wall. The reason is, she's now 15 and 8. Her Animate Dead does expert level 14 spell power. Yeah, 860. That's twice as good as it was before. She can clone, she can teleport guys over the walls. And she has 240 spell points. So she's outgrown an Aryan. Even though his army is still scary and it will still hurt. If I can conquer the Conflux and then hold the network of these four towns together. I'll win the game. Like, well, I'll win the game. I then have to fight Orange. That's, that, 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 that's what has to happen after that. It's not clear if I'll win-win, but, you know, I'll certainly have a much better chance without green constantly showing up, you know, like, um, you know, my span Cocker Spaniel down here constantly coming up to me like, hey, when are we going out? Like, can you come off the computer now? It's like, no, I'm in the middle of something really epic here. No, I can't. Yeah, can we get some more money? Let's just get some more money first before I start. Thank you. Uh, sure. Death Ripple. What is this? 
Temple of the Sea. Looks like some guy's arm. As critical as the juncture that we're at right now, I have to go. Um, it's uh, bedtime for the kids. So, don't go anywhere. I'll see you tomorrow. Do you guys ever have a thing where you're interrupted? You gotta go, you gotta finish for the day and come back the next day and you were right in the middle of this epic kind of momentum from turn to turn where you were really eager to click through the heroes and get the next day sorted out, but you couldn't. And now that you're back, you can't remember all the epicness. That's me right now. So, looks like we've been sailing with Nimbus, that's good. Uh, if I recall correctly, however, we've done some amazing things. We've defeated Fafner and we're in the process of preparing Septiana to come down and bully the Conflux. Okay, so we had here uh, Nagash. Nagash has 10 grand. He can give that unupgraded army to Stig. Two heroes can travel together down to here. She can pair off. Ranlu can upgrade can inject his army into the situation, gallop back here, upgrade the other dudes, all kinds of nastiness, right, we can create a really good secondary hero in Stig, uh, once we're satisfied that Septiana has enough resources to kill the Conflux. It'd be great if Stig could then be made big enough to take on Melodia, I think. Um, do we have any easy decisions before that? And what's Aiden up to? Uh, can we afford for Aiden to run around like a moron up here? Maybe a little bit. See what's up here. That helm is... Not insane. Am I okay with this? Yeah, let's find out what he wants. Um, excuse me, I think that's multiple... People who want the bird of perception? Uh, it's this, is it? Ladybird of luck? Oh, it's the ladybird of luck, excuse me. Okay, all right. Um, okay, Aiden, come down here. We might as well grab that sulfur. Make a decision about whether he can punch back through there. <sighs> right, how are we doing this? Big turn, right? So, Aenon, we expect as soon as he sees Septiana standing here, he's going to gallop back home. His home is down here, where he has no one home. Um, but he will be hiring another week's worth of dudes. I think with Septiana the way she is, with her amazing new artifacts that she's stolen from Fafna and Ranlu's army, that being added to what she has, I will kill him. Yeah, so the key thing is gluing these two armies together in time. Ranlu, when he comes to here, will have no movement points left, but that's okay. Because she's going to be able to speak to him on that square. So in here, we have all the unupgraded stuff that needs to come with. So I don't need to do that until I've done this. So let's do this first. Septiano, come on down! Ranlu. You've done good work for us, Ranlu. I'm impressed with you. Okay, I will speak to you. Allow me to teach you blind. Oh, oh yes, great stuff. Very handy education session for Ranlu there. That's what we like to see. Keep your torso of the Legion with my blessing, Ranlu. But give me all the good stuff. Um, now, you have wraiths? I have these I don't want. 
I might let Ranlu keep the wraiths, and maybe Stig will end up with them. Is this army and her awesome power... Yeah, I was looking at this yesterday. She can expert raise dead now. That's eight, eight yeah. Expert clone, expert teleport, expert meteor shower. I didn't even see sacrifices for living creatures only as well, so that's just completely out of the game. I don't think elementals, air elementals, and ice elementals will care about forgetfulness. It won't work because it's a mind spell. So the main things we're going to be doing are animating dead, teleport, maybe clone, maybe earthquake. A teleport's probably just better than earthquake though. We might blind, but what am I blinding? There's nothing I can blind. So a few of our spells are switched off. We've got Expert Shield is going to be great if we can cast that at some point. Expert Stone Skin, not terrible. Expert Shield will be very, very good though. Depending on how good an Aryan is. It's still going to hurt like hell. It's still going to hurt, but... I'm happy with this. I don't think these are worthwhile. 27 of these just don't do anything. Okay. So, how urgent is it to get this army moving? Okay, nomads and skellies. We just need some troops here. I don't think I need that many, do I? I can just do this. Will that be good enough? Arrow Tower does the rest? Yeah, surely. Surely that's good enough. Chana. I'm going to gamble. I think that's good enough. I'm not going to buy a Sorsha. So I've got 8,500 bucks. What does this cost? What's going on here? Yeah, 8530. So I leave behind. Yeah, I can't actually afford everything. I don't think I need to do it today. So Lizzie, you have a day off, love. Which you could use to go and do this. Or you could pop upstairs. I think I'll go for the free defense and save my money. Well, she's still not in a great position there, but maybe it's okay. Maybe that was stupid of me. Nagash, you stay still and we'll save our money. Right, okay. Anarian, what do you want to do? If you want to kill, come kill Nagash, that's fine with me. Randlu, I mean. If you want to kill Ranlu, that's fine with me. If you want to come back and actually fight me, Manoi Man Manoi Womano, that's also fine. I think what you'll do is run away like a little so and so. I want to keep it PG. Let's do it. Red breaking new ground. Interesting, interesting. That's not a great square for you, Merist. Are you serious? Okay, alright. Okay. He thinks he can win. So does the... I guess this is what this thing is saying. No. Okay, so the auto-resolve is hurting him, at least. Let's hope that Septian is incredible spell casting abilities can uh, overcome. <sighs> what was that? Protection from air shield. Okay. So right off the bat we lose many skellies and half our vamps to the phoenixes and we're going to want to 
get vengeance. Air shield just protects them against that, which isn't very good, and he's only got 21 spell points. Okay, cool. So, I could... Just have a quick look at how many... I'm trying to get a sense of how many we lost. Restores 760, which is nearly... Yeah, that's a pretty good investment. However, I'm going to get a free drain. I'm going to get six are going to rise from the dead just by hitting the phoenixes. I have my sacrificial unit here, which I'll use. So the vampire lords definitely aren't acting yet. The question is... These have morale. Looks like they've got... No, have they got morale? That looks like neutral morale. This looks like negative morale. Why would that be negative? Oh, because I have a artifact that gives negative morale? Yeah. Okay, so there's no risk of morale. We want, I think, to completely pile into the phoenixes here, right? With everything we've got. Shield isn't the thing I want to use. Although, now could be a, a good turn to do it. I think I either want to clone or Meteor Shower. 400 points. Uh, but that's immune, right? Oh, I didn't know that these deal minus 50% damage to other creatures that have spell immunity. Isn't that fascinating? Shield is going to be great if we can just get it in, get it done. Is that the best use of our mana? I have a perfectly good target right here. I'm happy to ignore everyone else and just really do everything we can in our power to whittle down these phoenixes. Um, a meteor shower on the phoenixes? That just kills two? Nah. Cloning our most deadly troop deals a couple of hundred damage as well. It's not that good. Okay, so I think what I want to do, I think the best way to pile in to the phoenixes without wasting his heal is to clone the dread knights. The clone will stand up here. One of them might deal double damage kind of thing. Then on his turn, one of his guys is going to have to waste their time or effort or energy killing the clone. So I think that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to wait until the magic alleys have moved. And as long as they don't make it awkward for me, yeah. I'm just going to clone this fellow now. She can't get a morale flash, so there's no risk of anything going wrong. The only risk of going wrong for you if, if the Dread Knights block my path, if the cloned one blocks my path somehow, but even that isn't really a, a risk, I don't think. I think this is right. No? Okay, it's not showing their turn. Oh, maybe I've messed up here. Hang on, I'm going to take retaliation, aren't I? I need to wait. Ah, that was a mistake. That's the clone, which will die to that. I'm going to, I'm going to lose my attack, so that's no good. Okay, I've messed up there, but I do still have this one skeleton. Only three? I really wanted better. I was hoping for better. I'm not going to lie, I was hoping for better. I think I want to... They have air shield, but they don't. I think I'd want to use, use these guys on this. No, magic alleys don't take it. Okay. Oh dear. Okay, well... Um... In terms of how we want to arrange ourselves to stop breath attacks from hurting us, we could just stand there, I guess. Put the knights here. Vamps go here, Bone Dragon goes there. No, actually, I'll stand here. Yeah, I'll just stand here.
Okay. You boys are gonna stand there, ghosties go. Okay. Five come back. I think that's alright. Then we do this. I'm gonna stand there to do it, I think. Magic Alley's gonna have a great time walking in here. <laughs> when it's their turn. Um. One perishes. Okay, Chain Lightning came down there, and that's the end of his turn. The Phoenixes <laughs> wasted their turn completely. <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Um, so what can I do? I could shield everybody now. I don't have anyone to raise except this stack or that stack. Okay, let's do it. Shield the team. Come on down. That's a, that's a high value attack. That's a very high value attack. So I'm happy with that. Right, well that stinks, but at least uh, we have... Um, okay. Kill 6 to 13 of these. Seems alright. We go for these. Yeah. Yeah, it's a conundrum. That's a conundrum, alright. This is kind of suicidal, yeah. I think I'm waiting. Don't, I just don't have a good play. What happened there? Was that good luck? No, bad luck. Ooh, bad luck, old son. Sorry to hear about that. You can wait as well. I have 125 zombies yet to act. They could walk up here and smack the phoenix. But I would need to sacrifice this unit to do so. Probably kill a couple. Strength 28 against attack 20. I have shield in response. Uh, yeah. I like that, I think. Bad luck! You're not even going to kill a stack! How embarrassing for you! Stand here. And kill one. With my blessing. Oh. Okay, that allows him to do this. And it does allow him to do that, except that gives you an amazing attack. <laughs> I hate magic elementals, did I mention? Um, how about this? I'm gonna attack the energy ones. Oh. Hey, actually, if I'm standing here, he doesn't have a square that he can land on because the sprites are in the way. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That works. And they've taken. Yeah. Okay, phoenixes waste their time trying to hurt that. Oh, that's good. That's very, very good for us. Okay, so again, I don't want to feast upon the... Yeah, I don't want to do that. Okay, I think I need to start laying into these guys. Who gets resurrected here? Oh, he's out of spell points. I'm, I'm going to get this. I'm going to clinch it. I will clinch it. The other thing I could do is clone these bad boys. And then I'll severely dent... the magic ellies. Only if I get the next turn, which I might not. They might act before my clone acts. I don't know how that works exactly. Cloning the zombies I'm not averse to. It's resurrecting these guys is what I really want to do though, right, when it's their turn. So let's just do this and be happy. Yeah, two can play this no retaliation game. That is a fantastic result, and now I can resurrect. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do this. Animate dead. Six come back to me. I thought it was eight, but that's because 
She's being dampened. He's got the interference thing. Okay. Um, I want to stand next to the water ones. Do I? Because they're going to attack. Well, they're going to attack them. So he's free to move, actually. Here, I've got a question for you guys. I thought Storm Elementals had no melee penalty. Doesn't look like they do now. I'm nearly sure in the vanilla game they have no melee penalty. So I might actually just... I'm going to do an edit to check here, because I want to go and find out... Is that, a, is that a change? Yeah, there's nothing in the documentation about it, which means maybe I'm just misremembering it. But I'm nearly sure. So I can kill 8 to 16 of these, 11 to 22. I could get some double damage. I think I'm going to go for this, right? It's just too nice. Double. Cursing. I'm just going to kill one. I guess it's okay, because I need the stack to get low enough to um, resurrect. Yeah. It's not too bad, actually. It's not too bad. Okay. Um, the Firebird has not retaliated yet, but the Skellies can trigger that. She's not very lucky. Yeah, this is perfect. We do have to deal with Rising from the Ashes, but that's okay. Ooh, yeah. Perfect. Now you can smack them. Three come back. That's pathetic. Utterly pathetic. Uh, I could go and drain, but I really do need these to die. Or he can block the liches, but if he goes for both of us instead, yeah, then he's got a pretty bad choice to make. I think I'm cool with this, even though there's more important things to be doing, but I've just got the spell points, man. I mean, only killed one. Wow, that makes no sense. Why didn't you try to get the zombies as well? That's strange. luck. Alright, let's do this. Yes! 16 of these. 10 to 16 is the damage estimate. Uh, let's see, 4, 9, 5, yeah, I think, I think that's pretty tempting. Let's just take them out of the uh, equation. Yeah. Go away. This is okay, nice retaliation, not too bad. Yeah, I don't want to do this attack, so I'm waiting. This seems fine to me. Should I stand back here? No, stand here. Okay, so the liches do get a shot away, that's nice. Sadly, they do act first. Oh! Bad luck is so bad! Man, when it triggers, it's really bad. I'll have to look up what the maths is, but wow. Okay, I really want to feed off these. I wish I'd written down how many of everything I had before we started. <laughs> I think actually the tooltip will tell me. Yeah, there's 16 available to come back. Okay, we need to be careful of Anarian fleeing. Um, if I eat these, it's... I get six back, and there's no one else on the battlefield who can help me get back. So I think I just want to resurrect them. I think that's what I want to do, right? Yeah, the pixies won't be alive anymore. That's an okay square for them to stand. Yeah, let's do this. They won't be there. So six come back, five come back. There's another 11 in that stack. But I'll use this turn to bring back four of these bad boys. They hit these, and if we're lucky, well, that wasn't too bad. Happy for this fight with the energy Ellie's to continue. Yeah. I don't think he's going to flee yet. Uh, just wait, you may as well. Okay, so that's a big, yeah, that's an easy resurrect if I, assuming I get another turn. You can't retaliate again. Thank God. Uh, 
Goodbye. So, there's 15 of these. That's more important than two bone dragons. I think you agree. Do you all agree? I also have 13 of them missing. I don't want them to flee until I've got them both back. I think I have to go for these first, right? If the energy alleys fly over, I accept the attrition. Okay. I'm really worried that if I attack, he just flees. 10 to 18 of them, if they, they, could, they could all die, in which case he'll definitely flee. I just wish the 18 was lower, but I'm just going to wait, see what he wants to do. Yeah, so again, let's wait, make sure we've actually got... Okay, that's good. So we actually have another turn coming where I can resurrect the vampires. I lose two bone dragons, but... Whatever. Lost some zombies as well. There's also a big pile of skeletons here. Ideally, if I had enough time, I'd bring them all back. Hang on, is that what I'm supposed to do? Should I even attack? Kill 7 to 11. I'll go for these ones. I want him to feel like he still has a reason to be here. Because I'd like to get a resurrect off on the skeleton pile, which is where the front hooves of the Dread Knights are. Coming over and absolutely annihilating them is just not in my interest now. He's got 168 spell points. I could bring the whole army back. Yeah, just don't do anything, bone, bone dragons. Okay, so before he flees, I'm going to do my next one. Which I think that's the next most critical one. And then I'd love to hit that skelly pile. And yeah, I'm just going to not do anything. It's playing into my hands. Don't you realise what this is doing for, for me? Yeah, because I'd like to go Bone Dragons and Skellies. Right, so again, let's just chill. Ah, oh, this is just abuse. Okay, I never got to do it. Uh, so what did we lose in the end? It's saying I lost 14 of these, but that's not right. Because they came back from the dead. I did lose the skelly pile and the two bone dragons. They didn't die. I, I don't get why... Why didn't it show all the vampires that died? Something wrong with the maths there, with animate dead. Um, that feels a bit buggy. Um, estates or necromancy, neither of them are doing much for me now. Um, she, oh, look, this is the trade, so let's, let's be a necromancer. So, huge hold. Awesome. But I kind of expected to win. I'm surprised that it was so pessimistic. Tell me that I was going to get my butt kicked. Okay, pink and orange are all very active up here. Uh, what's going on? Pink is here. Moandor. And then we've got... Chana hanging out with Alagar. Would you like to kill her for me? That would help. Alagar's interested in taking out the um, stronghold. Don't blame him. But he can't take it, I don't think, with that army. And I'll probably need to hedge against him trying to. 
So, here we all are. That was it, that was the fright. I feel like we can kick on now to the conflux and take it for our own. Now, do we want to be arrogant? I don't think we do because Algar, no, what was his name? Anarian will be back here waiting for us. I suspect there are creatures from this week he hadn't purchased yet as well. Well, there they are, you can see them already. So we'll want to just kick on with our best hero and our big army, I think. I can get to here, Randall can get you whatever you want, what would you like? What would you like from the menu of what's available up here? Nothing? I don't really want any of these, I'd rather take them all to get upgraded. Right. So spend the money on the stronghold. No, sorry. Wait a second. Right, got it. Sorry. Now, the hero I had in mind was Sandra, but she's been replaced with either Sandro, Sorsha, was it? Or G, the stone skin woman. The problem I have is I kinda need I kinda need someone to just defend it without a lot of fuss. Um Escape Tunnel could be interesting. So will we just hire Sandro for that? Because he has people? Let's do that. It's all too easy to overthink it. You just need some meat. Um, that's okay. He's got a spell book. So you'll know a few things. Great. Whatever. Sandro, I'm not going to read your history because I you're, you're really just uh, a leader of a bunch of ragtag people. Uh, I'm not including him in the roster here. He's just behind the walls. <sighs> right, Sep, what are we doing? Do you want to come down and grab that off me, Ranlu? Just these skellies? I could see taking the... Uh, See, I have no skeletons now, which is a bit sad. It's going to be the Dread Knight show, right? I'm thinking I could take these, though, with me. That's it, I don't want them. Destiny awaits. Can she do it? I can't believe he chose to fight me in the open. Right, Randlu's got a bunch of stuff to think about. Stig, right, where will you get to when we finally set off there? Okay, so Stiggy has to get to here. And again, if you've got time, you can do this. Go on then, girl. Sure, do that maybe. And then to there. Great. Nimbus, what is this? Oh, check this guy out. Look at this old dude. King Triton, what is this? Temple of the Sea. You stand before the gates of the Temple of the Sea, not a single mortal dared to enter it. Are you bold enough to be the first one? Guarded by Hydras, Sea Serpents, Chaos Hydras, and Haspids. Old Nimbus is there going, uh, you know what? My role is really more reconnaissance. Uh, you know, diplomacy. You know, statesmanship, that kind of thing. I don't... I don't get my hands dirty. So this is a town gate for those um, new to Horn of the Abyss. It teleports Aiden straight back to the nearest town. But I don't know how it works if there's a, um, a dude here. And I might just want to do that with Aiden, I think. Seems okay. Yeah, what happens if I go here?
Wow. I didn't think this did this. I thought it sent you to... I thought it sent you to whichever... Um... I thought it sent you to whichever... Uh, town was closest, but it's an expert town portal anchored on the map. Wow. Okay, so, yeah, if you've been watching the whole the whole series, uh, as I explained earlier, I've banned Town Portal from the game. But uh, here we are nonetheless, with fixed portals that anyone can use. So anyone can cast Town Portal from this square uh, and go and do something. If I'd known that was the case, I wouldn't have hired Sandro. I would have sent Aiden to do the job. Uh, so it's really, really interesting, isn't it, that they can that they can work that way. What happens when I click Cold Soul? It just won't let me because Thingy is in the middle. Okay. Wow. I think this is better than Town Portal. Like, having these random town gates around that anyone can use. Um, seems kind of nice. And it's a one-way system, right? So if he was to go to the Slough, um, where the paper merchants are, if he was to do that, he wouldn't be able to get back again. You can't, you can't portal back to this town gate. This is a one-way destination. Uh, one-way system. Um, yeah. Makes me wonder if I do want to send him anywhere else. I'm going to click cancel. Because I don't... Well, I'm going to get this sulfur anyway first. And he's going to go and upgrade it. He could get these, actually, while we're waiting. Why don't you go do that? Because we are collecting these. All right. That's still alright, that's still fine. Again, let's find out. Go to Slough. He still has his movement points, so that's fantastic. So run away, because I don't want you getting killed by him. And then he can hop around here, get the behemoths, could probably unlock this. Have himself a whale of a time out here, in Slough. <sighs> yeah. Escape tunnel doesn't matter, I don't care about Sandro, so I'm not going to build that. Alright, let's see what happens. Sup, Jenna? Does she need to just think about her configuration a little bit? Is that sensible? That might be. <laughs> green, green, green. Greeny, greeny, green. What have you done? Marist is messing with pink. That suits me love beautifully. Orange is dreaming of greater things, but here's a hero who maybe can actually do something. Here comes Aligar. Didn't quite have what it took. Took one look at me, thought twice. Who's that riding down towards the second necro? Uh, who came out here? You. Oh dear. <laughs> it's Melodia. Okay. Might need that escape tunnel after all. Okay, that's a headache. We're going to lose Slough, I think. But, in exchange for Slough, we're going to, hopefully... Oh, I didn't even try to reinforce. Incredible. Incredible. More map. Okay, that's clearly there. I'm nearly sure that the thing hasn't been found and that the the item is in the middle of the map, right? Because that's the last piece to be revealed, I'm nearly sure. Um, as you can tell, I don't get the grail very often when I play the game. Like, I don't actually end up getting it. Just because in the vanilla game it's easier to just kill everybody rather, rather than running around trying to f dig, a, dig waste your time digging and trying to piece it together before the AI gets to it. Right, are we ready for this? And where are your assets? You've got a man here. Erdemon, who can fly around. You've got Gernison. 
I assume we're up against an Aryan again, but I don't know. That's a very easy army you've left. Yeah. Much more straightforward. And there's no one here. There's no hero. Assuming the arrow towers all keep going for these, should I just teleport now? Yeah. Yeah, that feels right. Yeah, and then uh, raise these back up again. Alright. Um, you guys won't like this? Maybe someone would be stupid enough to attack them instead. I could teleport these, actually. That might be more fun. And then just do a quick resurrect on the zombies and these. The vamp's coming in as well, so I don't have a lot of time to muck around because the guys will tidy this up very quickly. There's no fleeing, right, so I do have the discretion to end the fight when I want to. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you idiot. I had to take damage there. Get over there. Get over. That's a nuisance. Oh man. So now I've got two stacks that need healed and they can the, the arrow towers keep hitting me each turn. That's very annoying. They're not alive. I should have saved them for the vampires to feed on. That was really stupid of me. Five of them are dead. Five each. So my only hope is that they shoot the vampires again? Yes! Alright. Okay. That worked out okay. That was lucky though, right? Lucky, lucky, lucky. I should be so lucky. I'm going to go for this. Uh, and I'm going to pop my head in to the Conflux, which I have finally conquered! Yes! Ooh, that looks like a tall mage guild. Oh, and indeed it is. Inferno and chain lightning. Sadly, I am water and earth. And this is not what I wanted. I bet you she finds some useful chain lightning there. Ice bolt, yay! I can use the orb of whatever. And slow. <laughs> now she finally knows slow. On day 100 and something. Day 70 and she learns slow. How good is that? I want to... You know what I want to do is I want to build that fifth level. Yeah. Might get implosion. Might get water walk or what's the other one? This is worth it. Doing it. YOLO. I'm only here once. Come on. Not bad. Not bad at all. Water elemental. Very, very good. 
20 points and I get 64 water elementals. Great. What is the clause? No other one. Once cast, no others. No other types may be summoned. Yeah. So my opponent can and I can keep casting them and summoning tons of them. Uh, not bad. I wanted implosion because I feel like direct damage is what she's missing. Sixty-four water elementals is kind of like clone. It's you know it's just okay uh, in terms of what it adds to the toolkit, but it's okay. What is this? Vault of Ashes. I have not seen this building before. It increases Phoenix production by one per week. Oh yeah, they've changed all this, right? So it used to be that you would get like just 50 Phoenixes a week. This is absurd. These are way worse than in vanilla. Like in the vanilla game, they cost two grand each and you get like four a week. And now you get two a week plus Vault of Ashes. If you've got the money to invest in the vault, it gives you up to three a week. So the Phoenixes are way, way worse uh, in terms of value for money and harder to collect. Um, which is a... I support the idea of nerfing them. I do support that that idea. My only fear is just ha does that leave Conflux with enough to look forward to, to get, to get happy about? Because the sprites are nerfed as well. Um... Okay. Oof, man, I'm tired. That was hard work, like, good hard work. We'd really like green to die and go away. We want these heroes away from, you know, we don't want these guys loitering around. 